WFAA-TV, Channel 8. The Spirit of Texas. This is News 8 Midday. There doesn't appear to be any signs of... Well, a Dallas artist wants to involve you in his work at the Deep Ellum Arts Festival this weekend. You can help him paint a huge canvas and share his dedication to public art. Here's Channel 8's Jamie Tobias with that story. There's no better feeling to me personally as far as uh, getting out and painting on a perfect day like today. Only Frank Campagna's canvas often is the site of a building. In fact, if you've seen this work on the walls of Deep Ellum, you've seen his artistry. How did you get started in this kind of art? Um, not wanting to have a job. <laughs> no, I saw a wall. Saw a wall? Yeah, Thank I saw you. a beautiful wall. I said, this is a great wall. This is the great wall Frank saw and approached the building's owners eight years ago for his first Deep Ellum project, reflecting the nightlife of the 50s. I'd say it's really interesting. It's got some historical significance on it. Another is on the side of a machine tool company, showing its earlier days as a blacksmith shop. Since then, he's gone for more contemporary designs and admits it's great advertisement for getting even more work. In front of this cityscape, he'll organize his festival project, inviting all to come paint a giant canvas of his design. On a larger scale, he directed Tunnel Vision, a series of murals decking the Good Latimer Tunnel. It's kind of like a swarm of bees in a way, because people come up and next thing you know, you've got like 40 or 50 people all painting on this canvas all at the same time. And you let them cut loose some, you know, and people are allowed to write stuff they want or little love things or um, a lot of political statements and, and very positive energy statements, you know, a lot of dreamer type stuff. Campania's a bit of a dreamer too. The title of this mural is As Above, So Below from Hindu Philosophy. Down below his dedication to the kind of people he'd like to see more of. Quite a list of requirements. Then again, when you're looking at the world from the top of a ladder, your goals tend to be lofty. Sometimes you can get up on top of some scaffolding and look out and feel like king of the city. You can get a certain sense of pride about being in Dallas. Just uh, kick back and go, whoa, I can't believe what I did today. Leaving the world a nicer looking place than you found it is satisfaction well-deserved. Jamie Tobias, Channel 8 News.